<laughs> this is Star Wars Battlefront, released in what year? Uh, 2004, yes. 2004, this is the PC version we're looking at here. Yes, it and, was uh, also released for the Xbox, the PlayStation 2. Uh, that was about it at the time. It's a quite, quite a lineup of uh, platforms there. Three, to be exact. Okay. Yeah, this game's awesome. I, I reckon it gets very intense at, at some points, and like it's just all round. It's a, it's a good shooting game. Like yes. well, this, uh, this level's called Renvar um, Harbor, I believe. Yeah, it's in the ice cave. Hmm. And this wasn't in any of the movies, was it? No, but I do believe it's a real Star Wars player, but it's in like all the books and comics, but yeah, no one reads those. So yeah, we're the clones. So the clones were first seen in the second movie, or the second chronologically, in the prequel tr trilogy for the attack of the clones. So yeah, we're, the, we're versing the droids, which are robots that kill things. Sounds like a... An interesting type of robot. Don't hear enough about those. Yeah. There's a variety of vehicles depending on which level you're on, and there's lots of turrets, and there's weird droids around that help you do stuff. It's pretty handy. Okay. I just died. Just got killed by a droid. Yeah, so here we I'm go. This, this is a good level. There's Planet Hoth, which is made Sp famous by the fifth movie. or Straight out of Empire Hoth, Strikes Back. Stri Empire Strikes Back. Yes. And it's... A similar thing is happening that was in the movie, destroying the shield generator. Yeah. Th However, well, in the movie, they were probably more successful than they are in the game, depending yeah. on how well you play. <laughs> yeah, all, all, all the objectives in the game are based off the movies, if they're even in the movies, like each level. So here we are, you're, you're on the top of one of the bases, yeah, aren't you? Uh, yeah, I'm sniping at these uh, enemies here. Right, oh, so you're I'm, out of ammo now! <laughs> yeah. oh, thank God. <laughs> now you can move! It just gets a little bit more exciting, doesn't it? So yeah, these droids that are around the battlefield, they they just stand there and for some reason, like, you stand next and they give you ammo and health. See the, the red bands across it? That means he's getting ammo. The yeah, the health one should be like this cylinder -y if thing. I think you see that. There it is. Yeah, that, that, that thing. Uh, Anyway, so jump back on here and uh, do Back more to abs. missing things. <laughs> yeah. This is pretty exciting. Uh, I love flying around because you can shoot, you just shoot enemies off. The, the starships have really um, powerful guns, so like if you shoot one of the people on the ground, they just go flying. Oh, this is a great thing. I'm trying to recreate one of the famous scenes from Empire Strikes Back where yes. the snow speeder, you wrap the legs around the AT-80, the giant walking thing. It's pretty fun. Anyway, here you're going to see some quality flying by me. Take a look yeah, at this. Yeah, this is great. Oh, look at you go, Matt. Whoa. Quality. Usually you would want to you know, stay away from the ground. Yeah, well, I think of myself as a revolutionary flying close to the ground. Yeah. No one pretty, else has done yeah. that. And I don't know why. Yeah, uh, I wonder why. Oh, look. Wasn't that impressive. <laughs> nice one. <laughs> what were you doing? I don't know. I think I was trying to actually fly in there just for fun, and then I blew up. <laughs> Getting into another one. Haven't you paid? Haven't you paid your insurance on the other one yet? <laughs> well, uh, this is Cloud City, which yeah. is also in the Empire Strikes Back. It, it, it's kind of loosely based on it. Like if yeah, you saw actually, it, you wouldn't really know it's Cloud City. We didn't, but it there is. There wasn't this big fight on Cloud City in the movie. Yeah, this is more really just, I guess, just for the the fun of playing on Cloud City. It, it's still a standard map. But I, I really like this though, because you can. There's what's close quarter combat, and it's really intense. I just find it more fun than the bigger maps like Hoth or Renvar. Okay. Moving on. <laughs> well, what I do like about this level is just just the atmosphere. Don't don't you don't you like the sunset? It looks nice, doesn't it? Mm. Graphics aren't the, uh, actually that bad for 2004. Third person. That's something you don't see in many games. Uh, first and third person. Yeah. That that is pretty um pretty handy. Like whatever the situation is, you can always find the right view for it. Yeah, this is some online footage. The online is pretty good. It it's, gets much more tense and much... Um, yeah, I like it. That was me helping out my buddy. Yeah, you can help out them. You can't help out me. You're not here. Well, <laughs> maybe I am in spirit. Isn't that nice? Those are grenades, by the way. Yeah, the red glowy things. So anyway. This is on the planet Tatooine, shown in all like the fourth movie and the first movie. Yeah, yeah this is... um. Yeah, single player. There's um, no, this is a pretty good map. This is probably one of my favourites, just because it's it's all um very tight and closed in. I, I usually like those maps. Do you notice the um, 
you see some jewelers around, they, what they do, they just run around and they fi fix things, which is weird because in the movies they run around and break things. Mm. But yeah, they, they fix turrets and like the health and ammo droids. They're pretty handy, but I like killing them. I might have a small fetish for killing Jawas. No, it happens to the best of us. Poor Jawas. Yes. <laughs> die. Uh, overall, I do find single player a bit too easy. Like, I am playing on the hardest difficulty, but it's just still too easy. You really gotta just play online. Okay, this is the planet Camino, which this is... This is a nice planet. Yeah, this is shown. Nice and bright. Yeah, <laughs> nice and bright. Oh, look at that beautiful weather. Mmm. Yeah. Could have a barbecue out there. Definitely. Let's go. Yeah, the graphics are pretty good. You know, the rain and the you know the shininess of the floor. Don't really know the real terms, but you know. Mm. But yeah, this this planet was first and only shown in the movies. Where in episode two, Attack of the Clones. Yeah. That's where they first find the clones. Hmm. I haven't actually seen any of the prequel trilogy. No, you haven't. No, I. Don't haven't. worry. You didn't miss anything. <laughs> the third one wasn't bad. Like I could watch it just for the action. But the second one. Oh my god. There's so much talking and whining. Mm. Yeah, Anakin whining. Anakin Skywalker. He's such an annoying little prick. Probably uh, interesting to the one or two people who actually is, are going to watch this video. Yeah. Um, I reckon three people will. Ooh. Nah, don't get too optimistic. <laughs>